most voters have about 15 minutes left to cast their ballots in this historic race for Georgia's 6th Congressional District. You're looking at a polling place in Cobb County where we have seen a steady stream of people there all day long. Now, the last final Channel 2 Action News poll shows the race between Handel and Ossoff pretty much coming down to the wire. Just a tenth of a percentage point separates them, according to the poll. And our political analyst, Bill Crane, joins us live to break down this election. Obviously, Bill, not a great day with all of this rain. I did a Twitter poll and asked, will it keep people away from the polls? And 70% said no, it wouldn't. Do you agree with that? No. Based on <laughs> historic trends, people tend to be impacted, particularly if they are millennials, mm -hmm. seniors, transit dependent. It tends to be a f more favorable circumstance, lower turnouts in general for the Republican Party. And Democrats have more assistance in organized getting to the polls. And so when you have dis disruption like bad weather, I live in DeKalb County, though not in the 6th District. Uh, I had to divert for two different flooded streets on my way home from work today before I came to the station tonight. And I encountered multiple flooded streets, some near schools, which are polling places. So, yeah, it'll have an impact. In a squeak election like this, it could be a decisive impact. Yeah. Okay. So our poll that we just talked about, our exclusive WSB landmark poll, shows that, of course, this is anyone's race. Uh, the poll is finding that the Democrat, John Ossoff, with just a slight lead over Karen Handel, and that's even as of now. So where do these candidates need to hold? Uh, John Ossoff got 58% of the vote in DeKalb County. He needs to hold or better that tonight. He will lose Fulton County. The question is the margin. That's where the majority of the early voting has happened. 80,000 of the 140,000 early votes have been cast in Fulton. Fulton's already had, before Election Day, a third of its vote. Cobb will be the battleground. It's also been the lowest county in terms of turnout. If John Ossoff can hold 45% or more of that vote, he essentially takes it tonight. If he's below 43%, it's a night for smiles for Karen Handel. Real quickly, we've all been taking bets. What time do you think this will be over? We may have a recount, and I'm not trying to scare people at home and all that stuff. And, and the TV ads will probably stop. No offense to at the seven station I'm management. Hoping. But there may minutes. be a recount because Georgia law allows for the loser, if the percentage of margin between them is less than a full percentage point, a free state, spa state pays for it mm -hmm. recount. So we may not know tonight. But I would say guessing we'll be waiting on North Fulton, 1030, 1045 tonight. Mm -hmm. All right. Bill Crane, thank you as always.